yo, welcome back to Neon Trash, all you cyberpunks and retro nerds out there. You got your host, Tommy the Hammer, coming at you guys again with another solo flight review. And tonight, I'm just in the mood to watch some old school anime. So, I'm digging up a copy of the movie Black Lion. Uh, this movie came out in the early 90s, and it is from the same makers of the original Devilman series, which is one of my favorite animes from back in the day. Uh, I've never actually seen this one here, so I'm super stoked to check it out with you guys tonight. When it comes down to anime on YouTube, I can't really use a lot of the footage from the movies or even the trailers without my video getting flagged. So I'm gonna be digging something up for you guys. about this on the channel before but the movie Black Lion is what I would consider a one-shot deal anime things like Funmation and Netflix a lot of anime is designed to be serialized um, absorbed over a larger scope of time but uh, in the 80s and the 1990s anime was kind of a new thing and um, you know a lot of people didn't really believe in it or understand it or uh, wanted to really dive into the subculture that is anime and manga but I've always appreciated one-shot anime because uh, most of them were designed for a adult audience they were very violent uh, very sexualized and um, I don't know there was this kind of punk rock heavy metal edge to the whole affair so finding a movie like Black Lion is the equivalent of going into a comic book store rifling through the quarter bin and just coming up with some random issue to some series that you've never heard of before but for some reason you end up liking. It opens up um, in a very similar fashion to animes like Ninja Scroll or Samurai Showdown. Well then all of a sudden you're wrenched into this other direction that involves a cybernetic samurai being rebuilt by Aliens? As I was watching it, I mean, this movie is only 50 minutes. I couldn't help but enjoy it. I mean, it was dark, it was sleazy, it was violent, it was weird. And, you know, I was having some drinks while I was watching it. I was having a hoot. In those regards, it's pretty fun, it's pretty weird, and I'm glad it's in my collection. So with all that being said, guys, I could give the anime Black Lion. I'm gonna go... Six and a half, almost a seven out of ten, guys.